Hello Makers! Welcome to 3D Maker Noob! I'm Joe and today I am very excited! In front of me I have the multi-material upgrade for the Prusa i3 Mark II and Mark II S. So I decided I'm gonna unbox it with you guys. Stick around! Welcome back makers! So after months of wait, it has happened. The multi-material upgrade is being shipped out and I paid for mine, I think it was back in October, about two days after I ordered my Prusa i3 Mark II back then. So it's been a long time coming. A lot of you have been asking me if I will be getting this. As you can see, I now have it. It was one of the first batches because it's been ordered a very long time ago. So I've decided that seeing as so many of you have asked me about this kit, I've decided I want to unbox it with you guys in preparation for tomorrow's live build. So um, let's get to it. So we will start with the first box. Piece of paper saying congratulations on getting the multi-material upgrade. Wicked! <laughs> Next, very important. Haribo, very, 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 very important. We have some acrylic parts. I'm guessing this is for the spool holder uh, or spools holder because they do include the four spool holder. We have some tools. We have the multiplexer. This is this is the part where all four Bowden tubes go in and come out with just one end. It's a good thing I printed this part two weeks ago to upgrade my Mark II to Mark II S and now I have another one here. We have more multiplexer parts including a an E3D V6 hot end. I know that Part of the delay for the multi-material was because of this. They had to engineer a specific one for the uh, multi-material upgrade due to the uh, different filament sizes, the discrepancies. So this did the trick. This is what houses the electronics board. We have some more, well, I guess this goes with this because they're both number four, more electronic parts or screws. Extruder assemblies, we have more extruder parts. I'm guessing this is for the spool holder and this is also for the spool holder. Next up is the motors and multiplexer. In here we have the stepper drivers, three extra ones because we already have one which is attached to the Mark II S and we also have the control board which is called the Prusa Super Switch. Sounds awesome. And our multi-material kit is finally unboxed. I'm so excited to put this together. It's been such a long time coming and I know how much you guys were interested in this. So join me tomorrow at about 10 p.m. CEST for the live build of this awesome kit. I've been slightly through the instructions. It's not going to be a very quick build, so it will take some time. However, what I will do in the meantime is I'll prepare the Mark II S. I will uh, disassemble the extruder and anything that needs to be disassembled so we can cut to the chase and just get to the live build. I'll possibly also put the spool holder together. We'll see, we'll see. If you have any questions about the multi-material upgrade, please leave them in the comment section below. If I cannot answer them, I will get the answers that you need. I will also leave a link in the video description for more information on the multi-material upgrade. For now, that is it for me, guys. I will see you tomorrow evening where I will be putting this together. And I am quite sure no blue smoke will be involved. So there'll be something interesting. That is it for now, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you all tomorrow for the live build where it will be absolutely Awesome. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. And as always, happy making, guys.